Roger. What you got for me, Jordan? Matthew Coney. And this is Jack. So, been hearing some good things about you, Coney. You too, Jack. Hey, we've been heard a whole bunch of good shit about you, man. I'm so happy to meet you, man. Sure, right. That was a nice work you fellas did the other night. I was really sorry to hear about your friend. Uh, I heard those gay boys turned him into a real dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, he was my best friend. Yeah, yeah, it's not funny. They're bad for business. Watching them were here a while ago and uh, one of them pulls a gun on me. I said, put that thing away before I shove it up your ass. You know what happened? As soon as I said, shove up your ass, came all over my kitchen floor. <laughs> <laughs> And nothing gets come out. What you do? You clean it up with full nine, or you did like some Mr. Clean up? I'm ready to do business. Sit down anywhere you like. Man, this is a nice house, man. You sell dope? This shit is awesome. Let me move in with you. So I'd like to really bring you fellas on board. I gotta tell you, I like your style. I like the way you work, but. Uh... We need to get you out of this tablecloth, step up your game a little bit. I don't know what the hell you call that thing. And you, I don't know what you're laughing at. We gotta put an eye patch or something and looking kind of like, maybe like a chocolate open raider sort of look we could put on you. You know, look scared, you know. Maybe a gag if we don't get you to shut the fuck up a whole lot more. But you're hungry, right? You wanna go out. Yeah. What the hell is taking Jasmine so, Jasmine! This wife, she always takes too long. It's always with the hair. Always got the hair thing going. You know, she got enough tracks to start her own railroad. <laughs> I heard it's pretty rough up there the other day. Gentlemen, I would like you to meet my lady. This is Jasmine Lexington. This is Coney. This is Jack. Back off a little bit. I'm hungry. Well, I'm hungry too, baby girl. Now look, we're going to take you to your favorite place. We're going to go to Chestnuts. I know you like it there. <laughs> Okay. Chestnuts again, Roger. If someone was trying to stick a gun up your ass, they know exactly where to find you. <laughs> Nobody. Who, everybody loves me. Nobody. Who wants to stick a gun up my ass? God, <laughs> maybe then two right. poop shoot pirates you guys knocked off. Yeah. The they like to stick shit. <laughs> That's <laughs> right. Yeah. Oh, oh, fresh, fresh. fresh. And welcome to my world. This is how I live every day. Beautiful. Used to. It's gonna be like this all the time. I'm bored. Roger, listen. Oh, honey, I got a bad knee. It acts up every time somebody wants me to dance. And apparently, every time someone wants to have sex. Or whatever. How about you, Mr. Kente? Would you call me? I just asked. Let's dance. Yeah, you got any moves? You guys are supposed to have rhythm. See what you got? Sure. I hope it's okay with you, but I bought a thousand syringes. I told you 500. What part of 500 did you not understand? A thousand was a better deal. When the fuck did you start making decisions? When I tell you 500, I mean 500. You still working for me. Was Jordan there? Where the fuck was Jordan when all this? Where the fuck is Jordan now? Jordan is dead. Jordan is dead? Jordan used to be a man. Hustler showed me a picture of what this bitch, I mean, this him, this she, this she nigga, him, her, or it, or he, ho. I don't know what the fuck this bitch nigga used to be. But this bitch used to be a man, I saw a picture. And I killed the motherfucker. I don't trust a nigga that used to be a bitch that went back to being a nigga that now is a nigga because she used to be a bitch. That's some bitch ass nigga shit. Now let me get this straight. You thought Jordan was a man? Cause Hustler said so? Yes. Look, I did what I had to do. If you have a problem with that, I don't know what the fuck to say. I'll tell you what the problem is. Jordan was my girl. I was fucking with her on the side. And then you go and make your own deal with Hustler. I figured between Houston, Atlanta, and Miami, all those strippers in those different cities, 
I could make a million here, a million there, a million here. And we have millions in no time. You stole your deal with Hustler. While you're making your million here and your million there, you better watch your back. That's it? Yeah. Take that lump of shit on the couch with you. I hope you know what you're saying. Oh yeah, I know what I'm saying. Oh. I knew John was a man. How the fuck you know that? I used to fuck him. What the fuck happened to you? You cut yourself shaving or something? You know what the fuck happened to me? Suarez, that son of a bitch. Don't worry, I'm gonna fix this, Cody. I got, I'm gonna fix this all up right now. I'll teach Suarez to fuck around with my dude. Hello? Yeah, you know who this is. Don't get cute with me. I told you to keep your fucking hands off of Comey. That's my man, Suarez. And you were fucking around with him. I told you to leave him the fuck alone, Suarez. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. Give me the fucking phone. Hold on, hold on. I think he wants to talk to you. I think he might have hung up. So worth. I killed that nigga two months ago. Well, that's why he didn't answer my call. Yo, Suarez is on the phone, Trey. <laughs> you would have got away with it, too. If he wasn't as dumb as a goddamn football bat. I well, shut the fuck up! We, come on, we gotta work this up, Tom. Come on, you and me, we're like brothers. You know that. We are like, fuck. We're like, we're like the little rascals. Fuck, we wouldn't kill Spanky. You know what? Come on, I'll call you. We're like Amos and Andy, weren't we? You were, you were, you know, if the Amos was really white, they put shit all over his face to make him look bad. That's why we're cool. We always been cool like that. Look, let me tell you something. You can't kill me. I'm white, you're black. If you kill me, the police are gonna come and they're gonna actually try to find out who did it. You can't kill me. Go, what, wait, I'll give you anything. I'll give you anything you want. I'll, anything you want. What can I give you? What do you want? Your life. 